from her dear departed parents, to the extended family whose loss will be sorely missed, to the faithful backup musicians who have gone on to a better place, and the adoring husband that left her life all too soon. Shania Twain's life-affirming melodies have made stardom her final destination. Her story is next on Behind the Music That Sucks. Man, I feel like a widow. Born Eileen Twain, Shania grew up in a country squire station wagon in the skull mining region of Ontario. Shania displayed a level of enthusiasm uncommon even in high school cheerleaders. But school spirit wasn't the only thing that singled her out. As the lone survivor of the crash, Shania delivered a soulful eulogy for her fallen sisters. It's totally fun to fly, but it totally sucks to die. Then came the realization that would transform her life life forever. Hey, that rhymes. <laughs> Shania's first single, Fun to Fly, Sucks to Die, would set the charts ablaze and capture the attention of one very special fan. For my money, it just doesn't get any better than Shania. I mean, beauty, brains, talents, personality. Wow. I mean, I was flattered to help out any way I could. But Death's Country crossover would yield its own sobering results. I'm dang sorry to report the whole Twain family was killed in a skull mine accident yesterday. Her entire family may have flatlined, but Shania's career was in no need of resuscitation. I'm a never say die to Abigail, even when people around me are dying. <laughs> A devastated Shania once again sought solace in her music in the achingly beautiful This Car Ain't a Home No More. Soon Shania stood to reap the benefits of international success. But her chart-busting catharsis had piqued the jealousy of a different reaper. Hey, don't get me wrong, Shania's a great girl, but she just needs to be careful. Bad things can sometimes happen to people who turn their backs on other people. Shania, meanwhile, would follow the funeral procession to megastardom, and an encounter with producer Mutt Lang would restore her strength to carry on. Oh, one look at Shania, and I knew she was the woman I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. But if Shania had learned anything, it was that life, like beauty, is terribly fleeting. I just know Mutt would want me to honor his memory in the form he respected the most. Man, I feel like a widow! Once again, Shania would pave a platinum highway over the bodies of the fallen. She's lost everyone around her. And when you look at the next logical step... I just hope she realizes how easy it would be for the two of us to be together. One thing is certain, Shania has dug out her place in the catacombs of music history. Yeah! Inspiring a new generation of adoring fans. How many little old short timers do we have here? <gasps> oh! And providing a lifeline of ass-sucking for years to come. <laughs>